Aggression in Akitas can be scary, and handling it is not easy. But you can conquer it with the proper mindset and training method. Most aggressive dog behaviors can be managed and modified over time. Watch to the end to learn how to train an Akita to not be aggressive. First, before we dive into solutions, we need to know. Why is your Akita becoming aggressive? In order to properly train your Akita, it is essential to be aware of the situation that causes him to become aggressive. According to the American Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals (ASPCA), dogs can be aggressive for one of the following reasons. Number 1. Territorial Aggression Some dogs are instinctively territorial and feel the urge to guard their territory against intruders. The Akita is one of them. However, they typically don't get territorial until they reach adulthood. Number 2. Possessive Aggression One of the most common reasons why dogs become aggressive is possession aggression. They feel the need to protect their possessions like food, crates, toys, bed, and so on, whether it is a threat or not. Food aggression is a familiar problem Akita owners face. Number 3. Protective Aggression Dogs have a natural tendency to protect their pack members. They may become aggressive if they believe their family member is in danger. Number 4. Fear Aggression When dogs feel cornered or trapped, they can become aggressive. Fear-based aggression is perhaps the most common form of aggression in dogs, especially those that are mistreated, abused, or not properly socialized. Number 5. Dominance Aggression if your Akita considers himself an alpha dog, the leader of the pack, he may want to show his dominance through aggression. Those are the common reasons for Akita's aggression problems. So what are the warning signs you should be aware of? Aggressive behavior usually starts as a warning before developing into an actual attack. If you pay close attention, you can notice early warning signs of your dog becoming aggressive before the situation gets out of control. Akitas may exhibit aggressive behavior in the following ways. Number 1. Becoming still and rigid. Number 2. Guttural bark that sounds threatening. Number 3. Muzzle punch, punching the person or other animal with his nose. Number 4. Growling. Number 5. Showing teeth. Number 6. Snarling, a combination of growling and showing teeth. Number 7. Quick nipping that leaves no mark. Number 8. Biting that tears the skin or causes bruising. Number 9. Biting with enough pressure to cause puncture wounds. Number 10. Repeated biting in rapid succession. Now is the most interesting and probably your favorite part. But also don't forget to check out the description box to access helpful Akita resources after you watch this video. Now let's get back to the main topic today. How to train an Akita to not be aggressive. Once you've recognized the warning signs, you need to know how to reduce or eliminate an aggressive dog's behavior. Things you should do when training an aggressive Akita include. Number 1. Learn about dog aggression, its symptoms, and how it develops, then your chances of successfully dealing with your dog's aggression issue will increase. Number 2. Give your Akita a thorough vet checkup to ensure his aggression isn't health-related. Number 3. Seek the guidance of a certified dog behavior consultant who can lay out a plan to correct aggressive behavior. Number 4. Another option is to sign up for an online training class that provides all the actionable steps to correct Akita's negative behavior. Number 5. Make sure your dog is getting adequate exercise and other enrichment activities. Number 6. Maintain a calm but assertive demeanor around your Akita. Your dog can sense if you're angry or anxious. Number 7. Use positive reinforcement and reward-based training methods. Number 8. Purchase and use a muzzle if your Akita bites or you suspect he may. Make your dog associate wearing a muzzle with positive feelings by wearing it about an hour before pleasurable activities like eating or playing. Number 9. Conduct training sessions in a safe place. Number 10. Use management techniques and tools, such as puppy gates or crates, to separate him from people and other animals. Things you shouldn't do when training an aggressive Akita include Number 1. Do not put yourself or others at risk. 
If you don't think you can safely train your dog, leave the training to professionals. Number 2. Do not use aversive methods and tools since they will backfire. Bear in mind that some aggression is born of fear. You may establish fear in your Akita if you beat him. But that fear will come out in aggressive behavior later on. Number 3. Do not use outdated and counterproductive training methods such as the punishment and dominance dog training techniques. Number 4. Do not touch or pick up your dog when he is showing aggression because it may put you at risk of being bitten. Now we will get to the frequently asked question that people often ask about Akita's aggression. First, are Akitas always aggressive? The answer is no. Most dogs only display aggressive behavior when they are in pain, feel threatened, or are trying to show dominance. However, if they aren't properly trained, Akitas will quickly become aggressive. Number 2. What is Akita's aggression age? Around 12 to 18 months of age, Akitas begin to become protective. Your dog may bark at strangers and be more possessive. Number 2. Can you train an American Akita to not be aggressive? Yes. You can definitely train an American Akita not to become aggressive by following the tips described above. Or you can get a high quality training class if you want something more advanced. Number 3. How do I make my Akita friendly? In order to make your Akita grow into a friendly adult dog, one of the best things you can do is to bring your puppy out as much as possible. It helps him get used to social situations and become more comfortable around people and other animals. The idea behind socialization is that you want to help your puppy get used to all kinds of sights, sounds, and smells in a positive manner. It's not hard to socialize your dog, but it may take some time. Starting early will save you time and effort in the long run. And the last question is, how do Akitas show affection? Akitas may show affection less often than other breeds, but they have their own sweet ways to show love and loyalty. Your dog might jump on you, lick your face, and he'll definitely wag the tail. One way to know a dog loves and misses you is by his excitement and joy when he sees you. Your Akita loves to snuggle or lean on you. He will kiss or lick you to show affection and empathy. I hope this video really helped you and your beautiful Akita. Feel free to check out the description box for more helpful resources. If you find this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and comment below to share your experience with other Akita lovers. Have a good day!